Hello everyone, this is Dr. Sam and this video is about cervical lymph nodes ultrasound reporting. We will look at ultrasound reports regarding reactive and malignant cervical lymph nodes. You will learn how to write reports regarding neck lymph nodes. The reports will include indication, findings and impression. This is our first example of our reactive cervical lymph node. In this example, the clinical indication is evaluation of cervical lymph nodes due to suspected tonsillitis and cervical lymphadenitis. These are the findings. A well-defined lymph node is observed along the lateral border of the middle internal jugular region that is level 3 on the right side of the neck. The lymph node measures 1.5 into 0.8 cm in size. The lymph node demonstrates normal architecture with preserved cortical thickness and central hilar echogenicity. Then you can write about color Doppler findings. Color Doppler ultrasound evaluation reveals a reactive lymph node with normal vascular distribution, central hilar vessel, and a network of central vessels are visualized, indicative of a benign or reactive process. After the findings are written, you can write the impression. The ultrasound findings are consistent with reactive lymphadenopathy, likely secondary to tonsillitis and cervical lymphadenitis. The lymph nodes show no sonographic features suggestive of malignancy. Correlation with clinical findings and laboratory results is recommended. Follow-up imaging may be considered if there is no resolution or if clinical suspicion of other pathology persists. This is another example of an ultrasound report of a reactive cervical lymph node. These are the findings. Multiple lymph nodes are visualized in the level 2 region of the neck bilaterally. The largest lymph node in the region measures 1.6 into 0.7 centimeters. All visualized lymph nodes exhibit a preserved fatty hilum and normal architecture. Color Doppler ultrasound demonstrates hilar vascularity with no evidence of abnormal peripheral vascular flow. This is the impression. Ultrasound findings are consistent with reactive lymphadenopathy in the level 2 region of the neck. The presence of a fatty hilum and hilar vascularity suggests a benign or reactive process, with no features concerning for malignancy. Clinical correlation is advised. Consider follow-up imaging if lymphadenopathy persists beyond the expected recovery period or if clinical suspicion arises. Now we have a case of a malignant lymph node. The image on the left is of a normal lymph node. This is just for comparison. These are the findings in this example. A lymph node in the level 2 region of the left side of the neck is visualized with features concerning for malignancy. The lymph node measures 1.8 cm in its short axis diameter. The node shows the following abnormal features. Necrotic areas within the node characterized by hypoechoic and heterogeneous regions. Absence of a fatty hilum indicating loss of normal lymph node architecture. Peripheral vascular flow is noted on color Doppler imaging, further supporting suspicion of malignancy. Here is the impression. Ultrasound findings are consistent with a malignant lymph node. 
in the level 2 region on the left side of the neck, with features including necrotic areas, absence of hilum, and an enlarged short axis diameter. Urgent referral for further evaluation is recommended, including possible fine needle aspiration or biopsy to confirm the diagnosis. Correlation with clinical findings, imaging studies such as CT or MRI, and laboratory tests are advised. Here is another example of a malignant lymph node and its report. These are the findings. A large, round-shaped lymph node is visualized in the level 3 region of the neck. The lymph node measures 3.5 into 3.2 cm with a short to long axis ratio indicative of malignancy. Sonographic features include loss of fatty hilum, consistent with disruption of normal lymph node architecture. Heterogeneous echo texture with hypoechoic areas suggestive of necrosis or malignancy related changes. Color Doppler imaging demonstrates peripheral and chaotic vascular patterns, a hallmark of malignant lymph nodes. Increased vascularity with irregular vessel distribution. This is the impression. Ultrasound findings are consistent with a malignant cervical lymph node characterized by a large size, round shape, loss of fatty hilum, and abnormal vascular patterns on color Doppler imaging. You can also write a separate section called Recommendation, which includes referrals and further required tests. Immediate referral for fine needle aspiration or core needle biopsy to confirm malignancy. Consider further imaging such as CT, MRI or PET CT for comprehensive staging and evaluation of potential primary tumor sites. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe and stay tuned for more imaging videos.